Welcome back to Let's Play Death Spank, Thongs of Virtue. I'm Burning Dogface, and I wanted to see what would happen if I teleported to an island or I did not leave the ship. And what do you know? Here's the ship at Green Island. It's a weird coincidence. Hmm. Got a whole ocean to explore. You're dead! What even is this place? Bleeding stone. Um... I'm gonna use items from here. No, there's no use. I can drag and drop them onto Death Spank. Yeah, I don't see it working. Oh! Wow, he didn't have time to bring the potion to his lips. I pushed the buton on everything. I thought it happened instantly. Well, joke's on me, then. Let me just solve this problem. Real, real quick. Excuse me! Did anyone else have a problem with me being here? Oh, hey. Yeah, let's get the hell out of here. Let's let you find a High Plains Green Queen first. Alright, me, if I was the High Plains, where would I be? Well, in the desert somewhere. Hey, this one's not on the map. Cliche Island. Huh, this looks just like the island from that uh, screensaver we had when I was a kid. that screensaver was called. Johnny Castaway? Or was that just the name of the guy? Shamrock Island? Oh no, it's more leprechauns. Let's not deal with that. Let's deal with that problem later. I'm just going to check all of these outhouses one by one to see if I somehow missed one that is actually labeled High Plains. I didn't think it would be that one. It was a hunch. Honestly, I still don't understand why Pokletad even got his own. Double shit. Okay. I teleported to the, uh, yeah, the first teleporting outhouse for, uh, old time's sake. Because I wasn't sure what to do next. So I'm just gonna ask what I'm supposed to do next. Got a whole shitload of cookies, after all. Uh, oh no, it's right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Find the High Plains Mating Stone at the Green Camp east of the Haunted Farm! Hey, that's actually really useful. Usually the first hint is just like, find the Green Queen Mating Stone, or something. I kind of wasn't expecting it to be that, uh, immediate, but, uh, okay. See, desert, oily, no, it was over here. Strumfuckle, Haunted Farm! I don't remember seeing a green camp over there. Well, this is east. Hey, that's right, I did find this sign that never actually investigated. Wow. Alright, I'll just deal with you. You a density potion. 
For times in my hulking size, it's just too much! Happy birthday, Deathsmack. I'll keep you over here, you enjoyed that. I should probably limit it to two in this adventure, though, or, uh, you know. Goddamn monkly outfit. What am I meant to do with that? Shotgun. Some might call it a boomstick, but that wouldn't be very original. All right, I wish I held over there. Oh, food. Yes, I need food. Don't crash. Hey, he's dead. Okay, everybody dies. Did I restart my timer? I did. Cool. Okay then. Wrong button. I don't know why I put that again. Better. Jeez. Uh, interdimensional chest piece full of strange energies from strange places. Yes, please. Make room for that. I guess I should just get rid of this stuff, huh? It says I can grind it. I mean, if those guys are, uh, frickin' nudist monks now, they guess they don't need it! Yeah, the plane's fading stone. Okay. Sorry about that, I just needed to adjust something, and, uh... I should have e uh, eaten while I had the opportunity there, but hey! Um... Oh, that's right. Mating whistle tuned specifically for the Green Queen and the High Plains. I'm sorry. I was dumb and didn't find this earlier, so that was kind of an anticlimax. But let's go immediately to the other one, and uh, hopefully that will work out better. I have a vivid memory of just assuming in the first game that the Green Exterminator would just turn out to be a huge racist, and that uh, Death Spank was an idiot for going along with him. Actually, uh, shout out to Jareen Amraz for pointing out that because he seems to have a tendency of taking things people say 100% literally, Death Spank has a lot in common with uh, Drax the Destroyer from Guardians of the Galaxy. One more jump cut for the road. Okay. Right out. And sort. Oh, that's much better. Greetings, Greem Exterminator. Here's the mating gland from the Queen Greem in the Desert Plains. My father will sleep well tonight in his feather water bed. There's only one queen what? queen left, so hurry back so I can clock out. The last green queen is on Green Island. Hurry up so I can clock out. <laughs> Makes sense. I suppose I'll need a ship to get there. Ooh, I've never been on an island, but yeah, I believe that's how they work. Here's the final mating whistle. Green Island Whistle. Mating whistle tuned specifically for the Green Queen on Green Island. Oh, I probably shouldn't be carrying that around, huh? Who wanted that? <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 that guy. Let's just do that and then go set out to, uh, stop the Green. And then see if we can live with ourselves afterwards. That's the real tricky part. Yes. 
can't remember where Strumfuckle is, but I can remember where the damn oasis is. Greetings again, Hermit. I have the well-guarded idol you wanted. You're still alive? <laughs> and that's definitely an idol. You bet your sweet well, let's bivvy. Let's try this one last time. Uh, get lost! Oh, I see what you're doing. An existential journey to lose oneself. Intriguing. What? Doesn't that, like, usually involve, I don't know, sensory deprivation tanks or drugs or something? I wonder if I can take on that dragon yet. What? Pass it or I just keep going. Look at all these quests. Yeah, look at it go. Let me just fix that. Okay, I don't actually need to hand anything in to him, so. Come on, I definitely want to know what it said. Hmm. Oh. Intro to Existentialism. One of my most challenging uh, quests yet. I need to lose myself. I don't think the Hermit wants me to return to him once I've solved this existential problem. What do you suppose happens if you use the cookies on that one? Die! Uh, uh, armor, armor. Er, yeah, yeah, I got that one. And... What have we here? Unsafe gloves, more look like my gloves cut into me, but it's really more of a puncture. Slightly better. Um, yes, actually. Oh, face... Ooh, thunder. Not a great sign when I'm recording, but hey. Yeah! Holy fuck! It would drop most of an outfit. Dragon Slayer boots. These boots would slay dragons if only they could hold weapons. Plus 70. Oh, these are better. And those look rad! No! Dragon Slayer shoulders. Dragons love these shoulders, and so should you! That's better. Oh, damn. Dragon Slayer helm. It's not made of gold, but at least it tastes like it! Familiar trinket. Looks a lot like the last thing. Oh, they're just getting weird. I don't want to, though. They look rad as shit. Oop. Chest plate. Made by dragons for dragons. Gah. Look how awesome I look! Wait, wait. Oh! Gloves, gloves, gloves. That jump cut was because I keep hearing thunder outside and I'm getting paranoid. If I'm recording when the power goes out, that footage segment will be completely corrupted, unusable. But all the ones before it will be fine. Hopefully you guys will get to hear me say that at some point. Knock on wood. Oh, right. Actually, I do need to go back to that thing over there, don't I? 
Oh, right, I didn't think that through at all, did I? How do you break ice cream? Well, I guess you could drop ice cream. How to stealthily sneak up over here when he's not looking? Let's beam over here so I don't just teleport directly to Green Island. That seems a little unsubtle. Or no, I guess stealing a ship directly towards the island would be less subtle. But whatever. I'll wear my awesome Dragon Slayer armor for this, and then reluctantly put on the better stuff afterwards. some friends who could really use some rain. I mean, it's warm up here, but uh, I've heard about the heat wave down in uh, other parts. All right! I didn't actually use that last time, did I? I'm here to do some things that these Grims don't want me to do. But, uh, Get back here so that I can kill you again! Man, no wonder he wants the Green Queens dead. They're uh, already replenishing their numbers. Hello! It's death time! Interdimensional gloves! What is it with this game and giving me all but one piece of a set anyway? I have done it! Green Queen Sack. I'll never for oh, Queen Green Sack, sorry. I'll never forget you, Green Sack number three. Damn, that means the other one did have a uh, description. Okay. Well, there we go. The race of Greams is no more. Wait. Well, there we go. The race of Greams is no more. I'll just be on my way. Actually, I guess I can just, uh... I always feel like it's to the left of that for some reason. I guess I felt like it was further away from the forest. Funny about that quest? No. Greetings, Grim Exterminator. Here is the final mating gland exterminator. Well, that's all of them. High five, my brother. That's it. High five. Greetings, Grim Exterminator. Thank you for killing all the Queen Greens. What do you know about generosity? Hmm. I've never had much call for generosity. But the army general is great at giving people ways to die. Go ask him. See you later, Grim Exterminator. Huh. Okay, maybe it was just a one-dimensional side quest, but whatever. Check out that one above that. I think that's an island. Uh, yeah, that's definitely an island. It's got a dock on it and everything. Nice guess. I'm stuck. My ship refuses to move. 
And there's the timer. So I guess I'll just continue spinning around ineffectually and uh, call it an episode. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you next time on Let's Play Death Spank, Thongs of Virtue. When we get out of this embarrassing mess. Later.